Gregorian chant, the soul of sacred music, and the body of the music you'll hear on our program, Sacred Soundings, music to deepen your faith beyond measure. I'm Al Romano, your host for Sacred Soundings, on listener-supported St. Gabriel Catholic Radio AMA 20, and streaming live on stgabrielradio.com. The Blessed Virgin Mary played and continues to play a supremely important role in the salvation of humanity. For Catholics and others who appreciate this truth, any and every day is Mother's Day. So we honor the mother of our Savior today with an all Marian program. We'll start with chants from the album Angels and Saints at Ephesus by the Benedictines of Mary, Queen of Apostles. We'll hear Ave Maria Celorum, Hail Queen of Heaven, A Rose Unpetaled, and Virgin Holy Marvelous.
You're listening to Sacred Soundings, a production of St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20, and I'm your host, Al Romano. The selections we just heard are from the CD, Angels and Saints at Ephesus, by the Benedictines of Mary, Queen of Apostles. Friars of the Dominican Houses of Studies in Washington and in the province of St. Joseph devote a good bit of their time and musical talents to venerating the Blessed Virgin. Here are some samples of their work. From the St. Joseph Province Friars, we'll hear Santa and Immaculata, Holy and Immaculate. And from the Washington Friars, Gloriosa Dicta, Glorious Things Are Said of You, Mary, and Tota Pulchra S. You Are All Beautiful.
You're listening to Sacred Soundings, a production of St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20. We just played a Marian chant from the CD in Medio Ecclesiae, followed by two from the album Ave Maria by friars of the Dominican Houses of Studies in the St. Joseph Province and in Washington, D.C., respectively. For our closing set, contemporary stylings of Marian music by the Carmelite Sisters of the Most Sacred Heart. Ave Maris Stella, Hail Star of the Sea, Regina Chaley, Queen of Heaven, and the Gloria from the Mass of Our Lady of Mount Carmel.
You're listening to Sacred Soundings, a production of St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20. We just heard several pieces from the CD, Lean Into the Wind, by the Carmelite Sisters of the Most Sacred Heart. Some folks wonder why we accord the Blessed Virgin so much honor, and even think we worship her. That, of course, is emphatically not so. The term is venerate, not worship. We profoundly respect and reverence Mary as the mother of our Savior, we ask that she intercede for us with her son, just as she did when he changed water to wine at Cana. One of the foremost names among the world's publishers and producers of sacred music today is de Montfort Music. Its namesake, St. Louis Marie de Montfort, lived in the 17th and 18th centuries and was among the very earliest writers in the field of Mariology. He said, We never give more honor to Jesus than when we honor his mother, and we honor her simply and solely to honor him all the more perfectly. St. Maximilian Kolbe was a Polish friar who volunteered to die in place of a stranger in the German death camp of Auschwitz. He said, If anyone does not wish to have Mary Immaculate for his mother, he will not have Christ for his brother. J. R. R. Tolkien, author of the classic high fantasy works The Hobbit and The Lord of the Rings, said, All of my perception of beauty, both in majesty and simplicity, is founded upon Our Lady. And finally, this from Venerable Archbishop Fulton J. Sheen. Let those who think that the Church pays too much attention to Mary give heed to the fact that our blessed Lord himself gave ten times as much of his life to her as he gave to his apostles. I'm Al Romano, your host for Sacred Soundings on St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20. Join us Wednesdays at noon and Sundays at 9.30 a.m. and 2.30 p.m. For more sacred soundings, music to deepen your faith beyond measure.